Everyone's in great spirits, everyone's got their skin suits on. Yeah. Seb's just turned up, gone for a warm up. <laughs> it's 32 degrees. No, to be fair, yeah, it's just got off a plane. Bleed out day, it's out and back, headwind, tailwind. So, quite nervous as to what could happen on the return. It's that team there that have the most complete lead out train here that hasn't been ravaged by COVID. There's a lot of sprinters here as usual, but there's not the strong lead out trains that we usually see. I think because of COVID has KO'd the peloton. Bike Exchange have a full roster. Like Lotto Sudo, I think are only here with four riders and uh, Jumbo Visma do not have a sprinter. Daryl's lost his camera though, which is a problem. For sure, he knows who it is. Just wiping out the YouTube competition. Exactly. <laughs> Second South African across the line. How do you feel? Podium. 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 Uh, protein shake. That was good. I had it. I yeah. put it in my bike. Good enough, Dad. Mum yeah. told me not to eat this food. Yeah, yeah. We didn't get it together, but it was so hard. You, you look like a bit disappointed. I'm left. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm cheering you up a little bit. Yeah, I am left by my performance, but well, yeah. it's not a bad one. We can't. We can't always just perform. Just sync. Yeah. These things happen when you haven't raced together. Yeah, but sometimes you, on your performance, you're a bit early. It's like our debut together, hey? It is. Never raced with you? No. But we were on a training camp together in 2010 without realising it. Yes. Yeah. Tucson Brothers. Yeah. I got, I got, I got one now. You were still in the small team and I was in the big team. Yeah. Yeah. But I was a small guy in the big team. <laughs> <laughs> and I was a big guy in a small team. Yeah, so. Now we're together. We are. In the... Biggest team. Yeah. <laughs> On a scale of one, per one to ten, how would you rate your performance today? Maybe, maybe a two. Oh, it that bad? Maybe. Just decided not to show up at the end there. Yeah. Pretty cool. <laughs> it's a mixed bag today. Rudy's top ten. Um, it's always going to be chaos in the end. Our final corner was with 60k to go. So we're into the home stretch with 60k to go. Like the straightest finish I think I've ever been involved with, with a tailwind. So we knew it was going to be fast, we knew it was going to be hectic. Difficult to stay together, which we didn't. Uh, Taj, Taj stepped up. Daryl showed why he's uh, the best South African rider in South Africa. Rick had a little get down, but he's fine, I think. Just some, just some pride damaged for the lion of Cologne. No, he wasn't lying today. He wasn't hungry. Uh, he was lying down at one point. <laughs> <laughs> so it's nearly eight o'clock here. It's five to seven, and we're still driving. Where's the body? We're still driving. It's gone dark. I don't know if you can see that from not being able to see my face. Oh you shit! You're doing it another way. <laughs> long, long days. Long days in the chair. Still haven't showered. There's a nice musk going on in, uh, in this uh, bus. Rick's been uncharacteristically quiet in the back. The lion is sleeping. The lion is sleeping. UAE, long days. Very long days. Start of stage two, we'll keep this brief because we've got to get our heads in the game pretty quick here because it's straight into a crosswind. But that's the that's the order of the day, straight into a crosswind. Today has the potential to be absolute carnage, which is exciting. And there's no one on this bus more excited than Sebastian Merrick about it. I'm gonna chop everybody, I don't care now. <laughs> Can't chop from behind. <laughs> <laughs> Seb's chopping the commissary car. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're just messing. I'm sure you'll be front group, Seb. We'll see how this pays out, because it's chaos, it's gonna be chaos. Be a lot of stress. And it could all still be a bunch sprint at the end of it all. Oh.
great. We have finished stage two. Lead out went uh, went well. It went well until the very last moment. It's just it's very stressful here. It's very stressful because there's, there's a lot of fast guys. There's wide run-ins. Today was particularly stressful. It's just a, it's a bit shame, a bit of a shame that no team actually wanted to tear the race apart because it was possible today. Every team was like wanted to be near the front, but no one actually wanted to rip it to pieces. So yeah, we just spent a lot of the day fighting for position, but ultimately still came down to a bunch sprint. And actually, with 30k to go, it was ridiculously slow and easy because we were in a block headwind. And that only really happens in yeah, like UAE tour, where you just you can be going at warp speed and then no speed. At points it would be it would have been quicker to run than to cycle. We did good as a team, we did well. A couple of uh, couple of punches, couple of everyone stayed upright. I think everyone in the race stayed upright actually. It was no crashes, which is again they, impressive. There was a crash. Who crashed? Ah, oh, an FTJ rider. Well, our thoughts go out to the FTJ rider that crashed today. It's very windy, very sandy, very dusty. There's sand in places I didn't think were possible to get sand into places. I got a new set of glasses. You really cannot tell what brand they are. I think Rudy ran 11th again, which kind of wasn't a... The result doesn't reflect our... our and Rudy's kind of efforts, so, but TT tomorrow, go up a hill on stage four, so Sebastian has to do something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we soldier on. Uh, uh, it's all, all good fun, all good fun. Very unique race. Daryl's first time. Daryl, how would you rate this race compared to everything else you've done in your illustrious career? Um, I've done a few race is worse than this, so uh, I've raced in Morocco and Egypt, and Egypt is quite similar on the side of the road with lots of dust, so for me it was kind of like I've stepped back in time, but the racing is much harder, yeah. <laughs> it's nice, it's good, uh, I think it was raced in there the hotels, we had, uh, we'd probably be hating it I think, I think the hotels make up for a good, uh, hotels and the weather make up for a good race. You're about to see Dubai for the first time as well, aren't you? So, see yeah. that big tower? That's, that's what I, tall. Well, that's why, that's why I came. Yeah. This is actually like, this whole year is just touring for me. <laughs> by bike. <laughs> You're not ticking off all the races you haven't done in your in, in career. My career. Yeah. Well, I haven't won in the in this uh, like the east, you know. So like, I'd love to win. This. Oh, you want to win here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, well, oh, okay, right. Well, if it's not this year, maybe next year. Yeah, I'm, I'm just happy to do a lot of the races. So. You know, winning's a Brucey bonus. Oh, tomorrow's your day. You flew business class, you muzzle. <laughs> <laughs> you muzzle do something. Yeah, yeah. You missed the lead out yesterday, today you were there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So you've had one day off, one day on, and then you <laughs> tomorrow you gotta really be on. So <laughs> What um is there a race you haven't done that you would like, I've never done Basque Country or Catalonia and I'm okay with that. No, I've done I've done all the ones I wanna do actually. Is there uh, any You've, done, you've written the uh, classics? Or written all classics? the classics. Yeah. Rubai never wanted, done it once, never wanted to go back. That's a, that's a common, that's a common. Uh, done Flanders twice. Well, I didn't mind Flanders. Yeah. But then there's a... Uh, nah, pretty much done all the ones there. Eh? Zero, zero to all three. Uh, the wrong, one race I really wanted to do is not around anymore, it was Tour of California. Oh yeah. That's the one I missed. Yeah. Uh, yeah, racing in America. Like, yeah. I've never really done a stage race. I mean, not Alberta, but that was Canada. TT day next, and then uh, up a hill. Another sprint. Another sprint. Up another hill. Go home. <laughs> Just to close out this video, I've just got out of the shower, now we're back to the hotel. That's a, I don't know if this does it justice, but that's a white bath. It's a very sandy bath water, so. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bring you more from the next few days in another video. How's your injuries, Rick? All okay, all good. 
We're good. We're good.